you have it on. Hey, Ernest. My name is Jack. What? Yeah, my name is Jack in the country, and my name is Ernest in the city. So, I heard you like my cousin Gwendolyn. Well, you're never gonna marry her. Gwendolyn, I love you. Would you marry me if my name were Jack? I love you because your name's Ernest! Mother dear! My daughter, Gwendolyn, how are you? I'm in love with Ernest Worthy. Who's this Ernest guy? Here's Ernest. Ernest, we need to have a talk. Miss Prism, I don't want to learn my French. Well, you know what your Uncle Jack said. He said to learn your French while he was gone to visit his brother Ernest. I don't want to. <gasps> Mr. Chasuble. Good afternoon, Miss Prism. Cecily. Hey, Mr. Chasuble. You should take Miss Prism on a walk. Okay. Would you really like to go on a walk? Yes, I would. I sure wish my Uncle Jack would come home from visiting his sick brother Ernest. It was nice walking with you, Miss Prism. Thank you for such a great time, Mr. Chasuble. I had a great time walking through the park with you. Bye-bye. Jack! You're home from the city! Yes, I am home. So how are you and Cecily doing? We're doing just fine, Mr. Jack. I hope your brother Ernest is okay. Well, Mrs. Prism, he died. Ernest is dead? Yes, he got the common cold. I take it you're Miss Cecily? Yes, who are you? My name is Ernest Worthy. But, but you're dead. Obviously not. I'm Ernest in the city, and Jack in the country. I'm Algernon in the city, and I've told you that I'm Ernest Worthy in the country here. Man, I think we got tricked by our boys. I don't know who my parents were. I was dropped in a black bag at a train station. When I was in my younger days, I dropped off a baby in a black bag at a g train station. Mother? Son? Jack! If Miss Prism's your mother, then I know who your father is! Ernest! You're Ernest! 